a social media food critic, Mr. Chime Time. Oh. He's been in Detroit for a while. <laughs> He's going viral yet again uh, for one of his latest reviews. This time, he pulled up at Mom Spaghetti. That's mm. M&M's restaurant downtown. Uh, let's just say he was not a fan. <laughs> This is by far the worst spaghetti that I have ever had in my entire life. You know, when I tasted this, it kind of reminds me of, of, of middle school cafeteria meat. He goes on to say that oh middle my. school cafeteria meat is actually better. Oh. He said oh, there no. was a <laughs> zero seasoning detected. Mm. In the meat or the sauce, said the sauce was the most bland sauce he has ever had in his entire life. And he said, what's up with this Parmesan? Y'all can't even get some real Parmesan cheese to put mm. on top of this bad boy? Got a zero out of 10. Oh, has he ever rated, rated anything zero? I've seen a couple ones okay. and twos. I don't know that I've seen a zero. This might um, be historic. It was really a scathing. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm watching it, and when it was done, I realized I was clutching pearls. Oh. I was like, oh, Eminem is going to get you. Mm -mm. I feel like it goes one of two ways, though. Yeah. Sometimes negative press is actually good press. Yeah. True. So if he gave it a zero out of ten and said it was one of his worst rated restaurants, mm -hmm. all of a sudden now I kind of want to try it. Right, right. I want to really, see it. How yeah. could it be that bad? Yeah. No. Oh, Al says no good. No? Oh. Mr. Chime Time, though. I wasn't going to say He's that, fierce. Al. The, the streets have been talking about Mom's Spaghetti. Well, you mentioned for a even long the time. lyric. Even Eminem himself said, you know, he said vomit on his sweater already. Mom's Spaghetti. So he told uh, he told <laughs> y'all why he threw up. Right. No. Uh, we did have Mr. Chime Time <clears throat> exclusively in studio, and we asked him about giving businesses bad reviews because it could affect a business very Big negatively. Uh, but here's what he had to say about that. I'll be honest with you, I do lose sleep over mm -hmm. giving bad reviews because I don't want to do it. But at the same time, if you don't if you don't care about giving me bad food, I'm not going to care when I grade you. Right. You understand know what I'm saying? Yeah. So right. If you give me leather shoe bites, <laughs> leather wallet bites, yeah. you, know, yeah. uh, you know, then I'm not going to care when I get in front of that camera and light it up. You understand know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah. that's just how I feel about it. People say you target particular So he says he's losing sleep. <laughs> what do y'all think? I do not think he's losing he, sleep. He looks very well rested. But he does. He does. He looks like he's <laughs> back at it every morning ready to go again. He has to give an honest review. Yeah. If he gives everybody a good review, yeah. then nobody's going to take what he says seriously. Right. Because then you go and you're like, what yeah. is he Yeah, this is terrible. We, yeah. we, we know him because uh, he's on Fox all the time, but Gordon Ramsay, like if he said every restaurant was, oh, it's fine. Like, <laughs> I don't know if that was terrible. Is that you, Gordon Ramsay? <laughs> is he Australian? I guess, I guess, he is now. I don't know. Oh my goodness. <laughs> um, fine. <laughs> if he, but if like he, the fact that he is critical and yeah. and feels that he can be honest about it yep. makes you trust what he says. So Mr. Chime Time has no choice. Mm -hmm. Do food critic? I mean, how much do we incorporate reviews into how much we care about A what lot. they say? No, I think the people should weigh in on that because yeah. don't you always look down further down and see Every time. reviews? Okay, I Every definitely time. at the very least I'm going to a restaurant's Instagram page. Mm -hmm. If you don't have an Instagram in your restaurant, I, that's already a mark off. I have my love. I'm like. Nope, not not that. I mean, I want to see pictures. Really? Yeah. Who cares about that? Because I want to see pictures of the food. I want people to be posting about it. Yeah, it absolutely matters. You don't think so? No. Maybe you could Ugh. be like a hidden gem, mm. not have any of the no. social oh. media, yeah. mm. and it's a word of mouth thing. It's giving like no one's ever heard of it. Nobody cared enough to I post it. I don't know. It. I'm just saying. Maybe yeah. there's a. Maybe, uh, tell us if there's a hidden gem out like, there. Like yeah. a like an old speakeasy. Like that like you kind need of a thing. password to get into it. I do love that. Leave producer, your phone at the door. Mm -hmm. Producer Aaron weighing in from the uh, control room. He said, hidden gems equals bad secrets. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. I agree with him.